It's alright. Yo guys, what is up? Mox here in our Borderlands 3 video and today we are going over new skips that I found in the takedown to skip entire sections of the new Guardian takedown. Now the Guardian takedown is challenging, it is difficult, and the puzzle or platforming sections can be a real pain in the butt because if you die you gotta go all the way back to the beginning. The skips that I found allow you to skip the platforming sections entirely which is really really awesome and not kill all the enemies in a few different sections so really really excited to share them with you guys if you guys are enjoying the videos and the content be sure to drop a like comment and subscribe we're on the road to 100k subscribers which would be absolutely insane now the first skip is coming up very shortly it is in this room after you defeat the enemies, after the three crystals, there's a room where you have to jump down basically a chute to get to the first boss. And typically you got to kill all these enemies to get the invisible platforms to spawn. But if you are a Mara, you can do a phase slam cancel uh, skip to get into this hole without having to kill a single enemy in the entire room, which is extremely, extremely nice. Um... I haven't tested if you could do that on another character. I'm assuming with the low gravity and 150 uh, speed from Speed Demon, you should be able to do it because Amara can almost do it just with Driver Class mod. Um, so I, I believe Zane should probably be able to do it, but I, I have not tested that. But that is the first skip for the takedown. Now the next one comes after this first boss. So we are now past the first boss and after you beat the first boss, you come to another section where you got to kill a ton of enemies. This skip is one of the best skips that I found because you can skip every single enemy. Um, and you can do this on any character. So you're going to skip all, all of these enemies in this whole area, which normally you would have to kill all of them, and jump across and land on this platform. Not not a hard jump to do. Uh, there's a little ledge sticking out. Then you're going to want to progress around the side um, and then basically jump up on this platform. This allows you to skip the entirety of that whole section and gets you into the three crystal phase. Now, I have found a way to get to the, uh, the final boss without killing any enemies in this entire section, but the final boss doesn't spawn. So unfortunately, you do have to do this crystal phase. Um, once you are done with the three crystal phase, which if you guys want, uh, I have a video out on how to do the first three crystal phase. The second three crystal phase, pretty similar strategy. Just focus on one, get one all the way done, and then work on the other two. And then we come to our next skip. So... The next skip will allow you to skip all of the puzzles and all of the enemies in this next place. Basically, uh, if you can see on your left there, there is a ramp. You're going to want to run up that ramp. You do not need to be on Amara to do this. Uh, you just need uh, full speed. Amara's full speed is 150 movement speed. With Speed Demon, you can get that on any character, so any character can make this jump. Um, however, I believe that only Amara can make this next part because it is a phase slab cancel. Um, you're basically jumping from that ledge, phase slab canceling over. The phase slab cancel gives you the height to jump over the next part. Uh, otherwise, you wouldn't have enough height to reach over it. So I believe that is an Amara only skip. Apologize, guys. And yeah, that is how to do the whole second phase. Now, the boss is coming up. And if you guys are interested in me making a guide, to defeat the Scourge very easily. I could do that as well, but I just wanted to highlight the skips in this takedown because there are a few and they make your life a lot easier when running this. Guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Just a short one for y'all. I will catch y'all in the next one. Peace.